KGR and Chartered Accountants Wood.Kernodit.com. Welcome to our video on conducting a feasibility study, a step by step guide for businesses. A feasibility study is an important step for any business looking to launch a new product or service, expand into a new market, or make a significant investment. It can help you identify potential risks and opportunities, and determine whether a project is worth pursuing. In this video, we'll walk you through the process of conducting a feasibility study step by step. Step 1 Define the project. The first step in conducting a feasibility study is to clearly define the project. What are you looking to accomplish? What are your goals and objectives? Who are the target customers? What are the key features and benefits of the proposed product or service? It's important to be as specific as possible when defining your project, as this will help you focus your research and analysis. Step 2. Market Research The next step is to conduct market research to understand the size, growth, and characteristics of the market you're looking to enter. You'll want to research your competitors, target customers, and any industry trends that may affect your project. This information will help you identify potential opportunities and risks, and will be used to develop financial projections and other key data for your feasibility study. Step 3. Technical Analysis The third step is to conduct a technical analysis to determine whether the proposed project is technically feasible. This might include assessing the availability of the necessary resources, such as raw materials, equipment, and personnel, as well as identifying any potential technical challenges that may arise. Step 4. Financial Analysis The fourth step is to conduct a financial analysis to determine whether the project is financially feasible. This might include developing financial projections, such as projected revenues, expenses, and profitability. It is important to be as realistic as possible when developing these projections and to use conservative assumptions. Step 5. Conclusion Once you've completed the steps outlined above, it's time to draw your conclusion. Based on the data you've gathered and analyzed, is the project worth pursuing? Are there any risks or opportunities that need to be addressed? This is the time to make a decision and move forward with the project or not. Conclusion That's it. Those are the five steps to conducting a feasibility study. Remember, a feasibility study is an important step for any business looking to launch a new product or service, expand into a new market, or make a significant investment. By conducting a thorough feasibility study, you'll be able to identify potential risks and opportunities, and determine whether a project is worth pursuing. Good luck! Thanks for watching.